what's through this door. Hmm. Okay. This looks rather interesting. Aha! Uh. And down. That was rather simple. This door open? No. This door? No. Do I go somewhere? Oh yes, I remember what to do here. Portal. And portal. But you see, you can, over there is another white wall. Which means I must put an orange portal there when I have the momentum. Boom! And yeah, there we go. Simple enough. Oh wait. Ah, there are two jails now. Beta. The first one was Alpha, the other one's Beta. I can see a pattern going on here. Oh! Whoa! That was weird. Hmm. Greetings, friend. Ah. I'm Cave Johnson, CEO of Amateur Science. Whoa. You might know us as a vital participant in the 1968 Senate hearings on missing astronauts. And you've most likely used one of the many products we invented. Oh, yes? People have somehow managed to steal from us. Bastards. Black Mesa can eat my bankrupt... What? The testing. Right. right. Now, you might be asking yourself, Cave, just how difficult are these tests? What was in that phone book of a contract I signed? Am I in danger? Let me answer those questions with a question. Who wants to make $60? Cash. Ooh, $60. Also feel free to relax for up to 20 minutes in the waiting room. Which Ooh. Which is more comfortable than the park benches most of you were sleeping on when we found you. Park benches? So, welcome to Aperture. You're here because we want the best. And you're it. Nope. Couldn't keep a straight face. Anyway, oh. we'll smudge up the glass down there. In fact, why don't you just go ahead and not touch anything unless it's test related. Okay, I'll remember that. Hmm? This door seems to be openable. Through? Ah. Uh -huh. Hey, look, it's more of these. No. If you're allergic to peanuts, you might want to tell somebody now, because this next test may turn your blood into peanut water for a few minutes. What? On the bright side, if we can make this happen, they're going to have to invent a new type of Nobel Prize to give us, so hang in there. Okay. The average human male is about 60% water. Yes. As far as we're concerned, that's a little extravagant. So if you feel a bit dehydrated in this next test, that's normal. We're going to hit you with some jet engines and see if we can't get you down to 20 or 30%. Right. Of course. I'll go in there a bit. And in the other side. All right, we're working on a little teleportation experiment. Ooh. It doesn't work with all skin types, so try to remember which skin is yours. Uh -huh. And if it doesn't teleport along with you, we'll do what we can to sew you right back into it. Creepy. Now, what's in here? It looks like a boat dock. But, huh? Borelia. Borelius, or whatever. That name sounds familiar. Ah, what the heck. Can't be from anything else. Surely. Surely! Ah. Oop. Mm -hmm. If you see an orange jumpsuit, hit the red button. Will do. Didn't I used to wear a red jumpsuit? Or didn't show in the first game? Oh, wait. You wouldn't know that, would you? Because you, didn't, you never played the first game. Geronimo! Wee! <clears throat> the control room. Oh, hi. Huh? Say, you're good at murder. Could you ow, murder this bird for me? Look who it is! Oh. I'm gonna let you suffer for a bit. <laughs> no, wait. Just kill it and we'll call things even between us. No hard feelings? No hard feelings? You've tried to kill me! No, I won't get it off of you! <sighs> Goodbye. I don't care. You deserve it. Hmm. Huh? Just get it off me. <sighs> Fine. 
She's scared of a bird. Potato friend, you'll get your revenge later, sooner or later. Hmm. Aha! Down we go! Whee! That was fun. Into the another sphere, and there looks to be like another one there, if you can see it. Well. Let's go into this one and see what we have to do next. 